Aaron said, maybe not your best stuff tonight, but you found a way to get big outs when you needed them. How were you able to bear down in those situations? Yeah, it was definitely yeah rough night. Uh, I was grinding through the whole five innings there, you know, trying to make some pitches. My slider, I feel like it wasn't there when I needed. So I rely on love and my change, yeah, and they were, they were, you know, they, they noticed that. So yeah, I make you know good pitches in this situation, and I was able to get out of that inning. It's a night like this night, like when you have to grind to get every out. Excuse me. What is a night like this like on the mound when you have to grind to get every out? It seems. No, it's tough. It's tough. Well, you know, my mentality was you know uh, give my team a chance to win. You know, keep the game close. I know when I don't have my best stuff, I can get, I can still get through, you know, through a lineup. You know, I'm not gonna get 20 strikeout or, or something like that. But uh, you know, I can manage myself to get to five or six good innings. What was the adrenaline like at the end of that fourth inning when you get? Barnhart to, to end the inning. It was really huge, you know, for us, you know. Uh, we got best loaded there, you know. Anything you can happen in that situation. And like I said before, they weren't looking for my change and a lot of that bad. So I was my plan was there was attack right in the middle, you know, not not try to overthink, just throw it by him. Get more out of an outing like this, where you where you don't have your best stuff, than you did the, in the last outing when you really did. I mean, of course. I mean, this kind of outing when you don't have your, your stuff, you have to rely on something else. And that can be your, your your fastball, or it can be you know your change. Yeah, I throw a couple of good cutters, with, uh, some guys there, but I mean, like you say, you know, and, and when I don't have my best stuff, I can. Still, you know, manage myself to to get through, you know, move finance. What's it like facing Miguel Cabrera when he's getting closer and closer to 3,000? Oh, for me, he's one of the greatest hitters of all time. You know, uh, he got, still got some wheels. He got to first base very quick, and he got good at bats. You know, he's one of the greatest. I, I love, you know, facing him, and uh, hopefully, you know. I don't know how many years he got in Detroit, maybe one or two more years, but no, he's a future Hall of Famer.